intro video, your mind by Amali. Welcome to another episode of Predis. I'm your host, Michaela Leano. This week, we're on Washington Boulevard. Stay tuned for the next half an hour as we bring you the latest in entertainment and lifestyle right here in Jamaica. Your Predis journey starts right now. Established to raise the standard of bartending in Jamaica, the Jamaica Union of Bartenders and Mixologists was recently launched. Let's check out the details and hear from some of the graduates. So we do the work and bring money in here. No for them, them we pop down. And rule the run the world, they mock down. Still let it no be we do has always been education and I have come to love wines and spirits having spent over 12 years in it um, as I say to persons all the time working in wines and spirits you work morning and evening it's a 24 hour job and so my 12 years is 24 um, and so having also traveled all over the world and seeing how bartenders and mixologists are revered they are respected I said you know what we can do it here in Jamaica as well and so it has always been my dream to have my own own school where I can impart a lot of this knowledge, um, a lot of know-how, um, international standards and so I'm happy that today I can stand proud and say that the Academy is here and the Jamaica Union of Bartenders and Mixologists is also here. The ultimate goal of both is to raise the level of the bartending profession. Um, we want to elevate the bartender, we want to elevate the mixologist, we want to elevate the bar. Right now as it stands and someone comes in, into the profession because I really have nothing else to do. I, I fail all my subjects at school and so it's the only job that I can do. We don't want it that don't, we don't want it to be that way. The bartender, it's a profession, it's a professional job. It's one of the oldest profession professions that there is. And so we want to bring that respectability to the bartending profession here in Jamaica. People are looking for great experiences, great service. We work in a high people contact environment, and so we have to make that difference. Bartenders are charged with the responsibility of creating drinks responsibly, paying attention to the recipes, not over pouring. It is important, we must take on that responsibility because the moment someone goes out there and meets an accident, it, then it falls on our conscience. And so if we are serving responsibly, understanding that the body can only digest a third to half half ounce of alcohol every 20 minutes, that is crucial. And so when we see our guests over drinking, we know it's time for them to have some water. The fact right. is they are trained here. They are trained, and I'm going to blow my own horn, they are, they are trained by, I'll say, one of the best in this business. And I say it's the best right here in Jamaica. Um, you don't get it anywhere better than here. Um, we are not just on making cocktails, mixology. We talk about wines. We talk about rums, Jamaican rums. You can't be a bartender in Jamaica and you know nothing about rum. This is rum country. And for a visitor coming here, it's the first thing you must speak about. Welcome to rum country. What 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 do you normally have in, in Europe? You used to have a Johnny Walker Black? No, come here. We have apple an estate rare blend 12 years old which it's tropical aging it's it's um if you took that to if you took the the appleton to europe it would be a 36 year old product so it means that we have quality here and we need to appreciate our quality quality in our products and quality in our people so what are some of the improvements you're hoping that this will bring to the industry well today bartenders don't even have a job description Right? But let me, let me make it clear, we are not a trade union, any at all. What we want to do is to provide standards. We need to have job descriptions, we need to have a standard pay, pay rate, um, we need to have a sick leave, we need to have health cards, basic things that regular people in corporate take for granted. Persons on this side are just yearning to have even a piece of that and that is what we want. We want structure to the bartending profession. We want persons to be qualified before they can say we are bartenders and mixologists. The fact is they are giving you something to consume in your bodies. 
you are giving them a lot of responsibility. Why would you give someone who is not trained that power over your own body? And so we encourage everyone to lift the standards up and we encourage the consumers as well to demand that the standards are lifted. Rumpa is so happy to be providing support to the Academy and Jubam. We actually started working together about four months ago um, with Debian and the bartenders. We've been coming in, they've invited us to be a part of their mixology rum training session. Because I think one of the things that's really important, in, particularly in the rum training, is for bartenders to understand the diversity of Jamaica rums. When you travel overseas, the mixologists, they don't want just one rum from Jamaica. They want all of them because they understand the diversity and the different flavor profiles and what makes the perfect, say, daiquiri versus zombie. It's very big in cocktail culture. That's what we want to help to bring to our service industry and our hospitality industry through the people that are being trained at the academy and it's, it's a fabulous opportunity so we're happy to lend our support in any way that we can, which we have been. You are a world traveler. Would you say the bartenders that have been prepared by the academy can go up against the world standard? I think they can. I think one of the things that, well, they definitely have the tools already. It's not about them not having the tools. Here, being trained here at the Academy of Bartending, um, they do have the tools. They, I would encourage them, though, to continue pushing the envelope. Would you describe Jamaica as the local wines and spirits or bartending industry? Well, I would say that it's come a long way, but it still has a long way to go. So that is where we're trying to get them. Do you think you could put into words the experience of the graduates here tonight? Having been a graduate myself, I can say it's a feeling of excitement and anticipating what will to come. I think it was a wonderful experience. Uh, we learned a lot. We learned more than I think we had bargained for. But um, we went through beers, wines, spirits, rums. It was great. So we had some late nights, but it was always fun. Do you believe you are adequately prepared to function in the bartending industry? Yes, I believe this is a great starting point for anybody considering a profession in a career in bartending. I, you, it's a rigorous course, and um, it's only six weeks, so you know it's jam-packed, but it's a really great starting point. What is the most important thing, or what will you take away from everything that you've learned? Probably the correct definition of a shot. How would you describe your experience here at the Academy? It's been great. It's been a wonderful experience. Do you believe you're now adequately prepared to function in the bartending industry? Yes, I am, but with more experience, I could, could go further. What is the most important thing that you will take away from everything that you've learned here tonight? I learned here tonight. <laughs> Um, just follow your dreams. If you have a dream, just work on it and follow it. A number of graduates today received certificates in Jamaican rooms, level one. You said wines was your favorite part. What's the distinction? What's the difference? The difference is wine is a little calm and a little sweeter, and it's saying a rum is a little harsher, wouldn't kind of give you a burning sensation. But the, the wine kind of go down and give you a softer taste on your palate. So that's the difference. I don't like the harsh. Harsh, that's why. Coming up after the break, we meet Jay Young and we roll out the music video premiere of the week. We'll be right back. One more shot. Our spirit is proud. Our spirit stands strong. Our spirit is pure. Our spirit is in song. Our spirit is at the beginning. Our spirit is there at the end. Our spirit is born in Jamaica. Our spirit will always contend. and Neville, our spirit. We are top man, we take charge. Have no we drink, we are shell down pass. Last like a star, we 
Cause I'm a galapar Over the wish me take it too far Texture, Yeah, at gal, we set the trend Magnum me dream for the top man them Wine with the style, no stop from spend At blend, back bend and Tech charge, tech charge Ready for the video, we are prime time Anywhere you see we go, we are headline We back, we talk, we don't want we are Cut the cock, no, we ready for the wine Tech charge, tech charge You know how you be Magnum buckle Slide and a glide and a bus big buckle Big sound a rise and the whole place crackle No, we turn up in a start Tech charge, tech charge Magnum Over the wit, we take it too far Wine with the style Wine with the style Magnum Sonic Wine for the real stardom. Tech Charge!